straight from the top. Three streams of income because when the shift does occur, and by the way, people always ask me, when is it gonna hit? We really don't know. Gary Keller has said publicly, he thinks it's gonna start at the end of this year, probably next year. I don't know, all I know is I just wanna be prepared. Think about it, when do you prepare for a storm? After the rain starts <laughs> or before the rain starts? So prepare now, get prepared now. Um, in any case, uh, the number six is um, all about financing. Now you've already got two lenders in your market center. We're just showing you what your investors are doing because they're not doing FHA loans. They don't like that, right? They'll do conventional loans, commercial loans, they'll buy within self-directed IRAs. You've probably seen that, right? People, have you seen your investors do that? Buy within self-directed IRAs? Happens a lot now. They'll borrow from their own 401ks, to borrow against their whole life policies, to do private partnerships. We're literally showing you everything you need to help your clients succeed. So they can so they can do this, which means we make more commissions. I should probably make this part of the part of the class. Um, in any case, uh, everything we how many members a guy named Zig Ziglar passed away two years ago? Remember one of his famous sayings was if you just help enough other people get what they want, we'll be a plenty of what? We want. It's called prosperity through service. Serve first and you shall prosper as a result. Okay. Last one is tax strategies. You definitely want this if you're investing. Either way, this is one of the best ways to strike up a conversation with an investor, given the tax strategies for tax purposes, okay? Um, all right, who wants to, here's everything in the program. You get all the, all the training modules, all the calculators, the spreadsheets, all the marketing, multiple streams of income, due diligence clauses, email support for the year, right? This is all for the whole year. The learning six weeks, the support is for the year, okay? Um, the weekly webinars and a strategy call to get, help you get your, your business launched, okay? Um, would you agree we built a pretty complete platform to do this? Okay, who wants to know how much this thing costs? Everybody yeah. does. Yeah. <laughs> I wish this guy would just tell us. <laughs> I, I have to, because I'm a KW trainer and, and a broker, by the way, I we have to follow a certain protocol. So it's actually more respectful for you if I show you how it's delivered first, would you agree? And then you're making a good educated decision. Like we know you want to make more money. We, we get it. But this is not for everybody. I'll be the first to tell you. This is for people who have some interest in investing, whether for yourself or your family or your clients, okay? In fact, how many of you have do have some interest in investing? All right, it's not a requirement, but it helps we will get, achieve what we call alignment. You know what I mean? It's, you, you'll have, you'll stick with it longer. You, you won't burn out. But you know what a better question is? This is what we, this is what we found out that, check this out. The agents who like the idea of working with business people, how many of you like the idea of working with a business, business minded person, the chiropractor owning his or her own practice? It's amazing the results you get, because you just have the, it's not just the, the, the philosophy of investing, but now you've got the mindset of the client that's in alignment with your mindset. Does that make sense, guys? Does this make sense? You guys should probably be the ones to do it. Whoever just raised your hand in the last question. Okay. All right, so what we did is we rolled it out in a pilot program four years ago, actually this month, four years ago, to uh, Catalyst, and we uh, and they paid they paid twelve grand by the way. Uh, you don't have to pay this. You're not even paying a fraction of this. I probably should have told them that first year. <laughs> it's way less. It's actually less than the cost of one of the commercial classes. Commercial CCI classes are six of them, sixteen hundred bucks a pop. This is less than one of those. In any case. Um, we measured their results, we broke them up into groups. And agents work with flippers, agents work with landlords, agents that did their own investing themselves. You can do this to invest yourself. The ones that work with flippers said it was worth it because my average flipper flipped four homes, four plus homes this year. I mean, if you guys did this and you just got one client and they flipped four homes, just a commission on, what, what's the average 300, what's, what's the average transaction size, anybody recall? About 350. Yeah. Let's just say it's three. So let's say you get 10,000 aside on average, 3%. And with a flipper, you didn't even get the buyer. You just got the flipper piece of it, the front end. Time short, it's 40,000 bucks. In the stock market, would a smart investor invest 12 grand if they thought they'd get 40 grand on the back end? Like with this kind of certainty. Well, what we had to do, guys, for, here's what I'm getting to. We had to lower it down to attract new agents. The reason is, is all the, some of the ownership, not all, some of the ownership groups said, look, we love the program, we love the results, but when the cappers are capping, they don't want to restrict to the market center, and they're the only ones that can afford the program, right? Usually people that get in the mass coaching are people that can actually afford it. Um, so we it down to the average referral fee, which to, we've updated it two years ago, was at that time 3,000 bucks. Does that look a lot better than 12,000? Okay, how many of you were okay to about five seconds ago? 
<laughs> well, here's the cool part. There actually is a, a reason to do this with your market center because they cut this in half for you. Seriously, if you guys do this in form your study group, and I don't want to pick on anybody here, I'm not going to mention, mention any names, but her initials are Louise. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I knew that was coming. It was coming my way. <laughs> well, what we, um, what we look for is uh, we, want to, we form study groups. It's just part of the agreement. for the. Mm -hmm. They do give a price break if you guys form a study group. It, the, the point is we want somebody to kick it off, and then each week we rotate amongst the group. So you would take the first week, you take the second week. All you do is you say, we're going to meet on whatever, Thursday afternoon at 2 at Starbucks. So we're going to meet next Monday at 10 in the morning here at the office. You don't have to be the expert. We just want you to, to we're going to help you develop a little bit of leadership because we're looking for teachers and trainers. In fact, for this particular class, we need trainers like yesterday. Is it, who, how many of you would like to be a teacher, by the way? Take, train the presenter. Have you, all, have you had trained a presenter here recently? Uh, no. Like with Antoinette or, okay. Mm -mm. I had Antoinette pick train the presenter and then take training the trainer with Dick Dillingham Austin. Awesome. awesome. Did you ever do that one? I haven't. No. Oh, he's a good guy. He's a yeah. good guy. Okay. Here's the thing, guys. Um, uh, let me show you this and I'll show you that the application, you can see how you can actually cut that in half and pay it off over time. You don't have to have all this up front. Um, we, all this other stuff, the added in since I was here before, um, the added social media, you get that. You don't have to pay for it, just part of what you get. You can use it, you can actually brand it to be your own. They actually give you ownership rights. How many of you know what that means, by the way, when, when a company gives you ownership rights to material? Like all the, all the marketing campaigns, what that means is give you all original Word documents, all the calculators, original Excel okay. spreadsheets. You don't have to actually create anything, it's all done for you. You literally just make, make it your own. Okay. You can get 500 bucks if you bring in somebody from the outside to, to, uh, tra to the uh, training program. If they end up not joining KW, you still keep your 500 bucks. Who likes that, by the way? We're, we wanna, we're helping the growth initiative. All right, uh, we do give referrals to our students through this, which I'll show you in a minute. Um, Conjures was with Beverly. What that means, she shows you exactly what to do from day one, the first five steps. You ever had a training program? Like you wonder, what do I do first, right? Local Monday morning. They solve that with this. It's a one-on-one -on -one orientation. <coughs> like, yeah. oh my gosh, okay. You can take it as often as you like. You don't have to pay for it. You just, you've already paid for it. And for your whole year, you get access to everything. Every, all the material, everything you get access to, including all those previously recorded webinars. We've done over 200 now. And they don't just give you like the, um, like the link to watch it or read it or something. They actually give you, the, you can download these on your computer. But you know what that means? You know what? That's like creating your own library. Guys, just agent to agent, if I, knowing what I know, I'd pay 3,000 bucks just for that. Would you, Daryl? Mm -hmm. That's 200 volumes of content that's above the training program. Okay, so all in, the whole entire program is you, everything you see, you get to see behind the curtain is what, what you see is what you get. Um, actually, if this wasn't here, <coughs> if that wasn't there, how many of you, how many of you feel like you'd like to do this program, like you feel like it could be part of your business model, and you could, didn't have to pay for it? Like, let's say there was no cost of the program. Now, show of hands, how many of you would like to do this if it was completely free? <laughs> well, I would see those costs of the program. That, that's a, that's a, a technique we figure out. We just want to figure out how many people really do have sincere interest. The challenge is, is a lot of people, it's, it's the money thing that holds you back. You probably can't afford it. It's just that Al McDonald back here is telling you, you know, caution, right? It's just part of being human nature. There's nothing we can do about it other than to show you everything and let you make it the fact-based decision. In any case, um, if you could pay this off over time, would that help any of you? How many of you could, if you could pay it off over time, that would help you? Pay it off over time, okay? Well, here's, let me show you how we do this then. Everything you see up here if you were to form a study group, like you sign up and you form a study group, they actually cut that in half. Uh, let me let me just show you this. It'll make a lot more sense. Um, hey, hey Daryl, can you help me yeah. handle this out? Um, there should be plenty. Let me, let me. Excuse, you mentioned this was kind of like old or something, but like a level above it. It's the, the methodology, the learning methodology called LMS, Learning and Management System. Old is called Experiential Training. That's okay. that methodology. This methodology is the evolution of 
experiential training. Okay. It's called regression based learning. Yeah. The one thing this marketing center does, I don't know if you would honor or not, but if you do X amount of transactions, you get that money back. Is that something that you Well, then we do that with Bold. Yeah, for this Bold does that. I didn't know if you guys No, Bold doesn't do that. Adele DeMauro does that. Oh, okay. That's, that's yeah. Adele DeMauro pays that. Oh, I didn't know Bold. that. Okay. Yeah, that's usually, that's, that's the ownership <laughs> group. It's at the regional level. So you have market center ownership groups in a region, and you got KWI. ROP does. Yeah, so what, what we do here is this is um, uh, they made it, we made that, we had the company agree to lower the price down even more so we could attract some of the newer guys. And uh, I mean, would you guys agree, 1500 bucks is like, that's like freaking giving this thing away, you know? How many of you ever had a trainer before? Like a coach or a trainer? Show of hands? All right, let me ask this question. How many of you know somebody on New Year's Day joined a gym? Years, there was We're in the room. I just, just saying this. Probably a few of us in the yeah. room. All right. Now, did you know that 97% of people who join a gym never go back to the second time? Now, would you say that if, if it's clients who get a trainer, a personal trainer, do they show up more often to the gym? Would you agree? Would you say they get more results? Yeah. Well, that's the difference with this. You actually get one-on-one. -on -one. In fact, I'm going to give you my cell phone number. Um, Okay, let me get through this because I got to go through more material, but I want to show you how this payment thing works. Because some of you are probably sort of figured this out. Um, all right, on your form, if you could do this, uh, there it is. All right, see where it says right after the name and address stuff where it says please choose one. Go ahead and get your pens out. I want you to go ahead and do this now. Cross off where it says option one that three or twenty nine ninety seven. That becomes fifteen hundred. Okay, that's if you paid in full. That's all it is. It's literally everything here is literally half. You want to cross off what's on the form and put in half of what's here. It's half what's on the form. So option two, that becomes eighteen hundred. That's if you do a payment plan. Payment plan is if you do option two that's payment plan. That 600 becomes 300. That's all it is for the deposit. Literally, you could get in and get your material and start producing it. Um, and then the payments are only 150. That's it. Starting to sound a little bit better? All right. All right, real quick here. I want to try to get an idea, but here's the challenge. Um, every one of you can apply because you all sat in the class. The prerequisite is you got to sit in the class. The class is also part of the program. You actually got part of the program today. It's the honor system. Uh, we gave you material because we want you to make a good educated decision. But here's the challenge. Every region has its own headcount. Into the, into the, you're allowed so many people in the program. And every market center has its own headcount. I don't know what your headcount is. <laughs> they used to tell me and people would ask, well, what's our headcount? And I would say six. And then the only adapters would do their form and everybody else was left there wondering what to do. If you don't do it with your market center, the waiting list is two years, okay? Um, the only other option you have is to go to another market center, another region, something like that. What I recommend is this. If you, if you believe you're interested in, in doing this, I have to actually number these as I get them. I have to number the forms. One, two, three, four, five, six, whatever. A um, couple things. If you have a family member who's interested in investing, it could be spouse, parent, child, brother, sister, you can bring them in with you. You don't get separate IDs and separate strategy calls. You have to join, you have to go through with you on your strategy call, okay? Um, again, it's the honor system. We trust you. We know you're going to produce. We, we believe you. Uh, we just ask you to be mindful that uh, there is a, a huge demand for this and a lot of strain for the program. All right, real quick. For the new folks, good news. Um, how many of you are new again, like relatively new? All right, that the My Vista Services does guarantee it 100%. And not just the six weeks of the learning, the entire one year of the, the, the program. I mean, they literally remove all the risk, okay? Um, I will tell you this, everybody who does participate in the program, like you actively participate, every single student produces. Seriously, even no exception. And it's not me, guys. It's not me, it's, it's the program. It's you working the program and me guiding you through the program. Um, Daryl's being trained so he can take people on. I know for me, it took a couple years, but for, for your group, by the way, you're, I, um, I was going to say you're stuck with me. I hope I passed and know you like your stuff. Because I, I, whatever training, whatever class that I teach, that I, you come through, you're my student for the next year. So I hope that's okay. Is that okay? 
Actually, real quick, how many of you are thinking, how many of you are serious about the study group? Let me ask that question. Show of hands. Well, the study group part of that. Yeah. The study group, <laughs> what I'm getting at is the study group is, um, I promise you you'll move through to re more results faster by being in a study group, okay? Um, so any case, real quick, let me get through this. Um, there is a, they, the company does three-day events. I'll talk about that in a minute. They're doing one in, right, in the August. Hills. August 24th, uh, 24th 25th, 25th, 26th. 26th is a half a day. Um, you guys get to go for free. So, I mean, if the ones of you are doing the training program, they include in your tuition that three days. And the cool thing is if you're really interested in more about flipping and buying rentals, um, they give you the content for all five training programs in the three days. And you know, you, and you're close enough, you can drive to it. So it's like an hour from here, right? Yeah, sure, sure yeah. yeah. Good Lord. How many of you would like to be part of that? Three days so you don't have to pay for it. I would. Just me? <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right, these are production results from agents. It was one agent, one client connect. From, we asked the agents, give us one of your clients results for one year. So that agent got 54 grand from that one client in one year. That agent got 28 from that client. Different agents, different client combinations. That agent got 30 from that client in commissions. That agent got 35 from that client. Ooh. It looked like that's, what, that's a salary. One client brought in that much commission in one year for that one agent. And I bet they're an engineer. Look, they're buying multis. That's what engineers do. Um, Ray and Eric, I don't know if it's a girl or a guy. Oh, write this down. Uh, this is um, from Dave Ramsey. What are you going to do with your money? That's you want to write this down for yourselves to answer tonight, not for me for yourself. The reason is, is we found out uh, when we measure our results, like we're doing yeah. pretty good. Like this class, guys, I'm going to teach you how to build wealth and income with your license. Okay. The challenge is, we found out a lot of you are starting to buy leads. Like we teach you how to make money, and then you want more, so you go buy leads, thinking it's easy. It's not easy. Those leads are not all that great. Has anybody bought leads before? Jill or Julia? You know what I'm talking about? Can I tell you? Yes. I, I bought Zillow, I started with Zillow um, three years ago, and I'm here in this office two, and, two years and four months. I got great leads. I had Monroe, I paid for the Monroe zip code, and I yeah. closed 22 of my leads in one year came from Zillow. Yeah, I used to do it too, and I did pretty good. Then it got so busy, but here's the thing. When we buy a leads, if we stop paying for the leads, what happens to our business? It goes away. Yeah. But what if you're building your own lead machine? Then you're okay. I've had people tell me, like call me up after the program and say, I feel like I won the lottery. And I'm like, well, you didn't win the lottery, but you sure learned how to build your lottery machine. Does that make sense? So um, so we would rather have you invest more in yourselves, you know, buy properties, things like that, with, with your earning income. Anyways, two more things and I'll take questions. Uh, first thing is this. We did build a community site. Uh, it was after I was here the last time because a lot of agents were saying, we want to network with each other, how can we do that? And we said, okay, we'll build a community site. And uh, the, one of the benefits is obviously you can get, you can send referrals back and forth. Um, in fact, if you look at your ownership of your properties, you'll find out a lot of your properties are more and more being owned by foreign owners. Have you guys seen that? They're not just investing here, they're investing in all those other places. So you could send a transaction down here to Oklahoma City or, or Dallas, right? Which means you just earned a referral fee. Okay, you don't have to pay for this by the way. This is part of the program. But here's the part I want to get to. Um, how many of you have ever been out on Long Island before to a little area called Manhasset? You might know where Manhasset is? I did. So we got a market center there. And Teresa Martin is our broker of record for that market center. She's a KW broker, she's an attorney, and she's an investor. Well, she runs the New York City Investors Club. It's a big REA group. She called me up after the training program. She said, Would you come teach my REA group? And I said, Sure. So I went up there to Manhattan, Midtown, taught the group. Some of the investors did get their license and they joined who? KW. KW. But here's the cool part. Some investors just won't get their license. It's, it's okay. But at least they now know who to work with. Who are they going to be choosing to work with now? All these guys. So we started putting investors on here too. It's a closed network. You can't find us online. You have to be in a program or pass through the program to be on here. We did start adding investors through the REA organization. Here's why. I, I got invited to teach at the National REA conference this last year and I went and spoke. I've now been invited to 28 different rear groups to, 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 to give them this presentation including New Jersey. You've got South Jersey, you've got several different groups. Um, the point is we put these investors on here, now they can find you directly, right? 
which means you just earned a commission, but you did not have to pay what for that commission? No referral fee. Does this make you guys feel a little bit better? You guys, who's here was okay till about five minutes ago? <laughs> you guys okay? Hey guys, just relax, honestly. Um, this is for people who are really ready, willing, and able to do some training to improve their business, like not just with owner occupants, but add the other business streams. Does that make sense? Flippers, landlords, the whole nine yards. Um, let me show you one more thing and I'll, I'll stop for questions. Um, just this year, we keep adding to the program. You don't have to pay for it. Every time they add stuff, you got it, you get it for free. Two of the things I want to point out are uh, really big winners is we bought the license for what's called a cash buyer's report. When we negotiated with them, it was either uh, you pay 200 bucks a month for it or we pay 30,000 bucks. We paid the 30,000 bucks for it. Cash buyer's report shows you on demand who's paying cash for properties in your area. You can go back five years. You can see the properties they bought and you get that buyer's contact information. How many of you would like to work with people who buy properties with cash? Oh my gosh. All right, here's the test. Class, test for the class. Who here can think of a marketing campaign you learned about today that you can use with cash buyers? Which one would you say it is? Well, the booklet. Yeah. Find out what they're buying, build a booklet with properties that are like the ones they're buying. Bingo, right? That's exactly what we do. Private lenders report. Anybody have investors that could use more money, like more financing? If they're, they're not hard money lenders. I mean, some of them are, but most of them are. They show you the properties they finance, so you know who which ones to call based on what your client's buying, and you get, of course, your contact information. Who'd like to have these two things? If I had this 20 years ago, I'd, I'd be, I wish I had the whole thing 20 years ago. Okay, um, I better stop because I'll keep talking and talking and talking. Who has questions? I have a question. Yes, ma'am. Yes. go on Zillow, they find something we can't find on the MLS, it's on an auction site, it's, yep. you know, is in this program resources for us to streamline that yes. search for these buyers, whether it's a flipper, or somebody that wants multi-property, yeah. whatever the case is. There, there is, there's a process, what, what's your first name? <coughs> I'm sorry, Sharon. Sharon, there's, um, there's academic skills, like I can teach, a calculator in five, sec five minutes. And there's behavioral skills. So what you just described there, there's a behavioral pattern we teach called behavioral skills. It does take about four weeks to master it. It only takes a half hour to learn it, but you have to practice this. And what we do is we show you exactly the behavioral patterns you need to exhibit with your clients. That's where the real money is. I mean, I, I can sit up here and teach you all kinds of calculators and spreadsheets, but quite frankly, you go back out there doing the same stuff. In fact, how many of you have been frustrated working with investors so far? Yeah. How would you like to learn to work with these kind of investors and not have all that frustration? Well, there actually is a method to the process. So we do, the answer is yes. There's one set for flippers and one set for uh, uh, people buying rentals. Different sets of different behavioral patterns. Very similar, uh, but we teach them separately, right? Correct. So what I'm getting at is your clients are going to bring to you, I looked on Zillow and I found X. And you go out there and you can't find X anywhere in the MLS. So the pattern is this. We want you to show you how to show them how you're identifying the properties. So uh, um, we talked about the letter, remember? We talked about the letter. That's exactly what I'm talking about. When we show you how to do that, uh, we want you to show your clients how you're determining the properties and the people. Not so they can do it themselves, so they would understand how and why did you do what we're doing. Does that make sense? In fact, everything we give you is not intended to keep to yourself. It's, this is intended to share with your clients, like their school report, the list of data. When we share that kind of stuff with our clients, what does that do for our credibility? It goes up, yeah. So the behavioral patterns, yes, you do, you do learn some skills, absolutely. We're gonna give you all the skills, but if we didn't give you the behavioral patterns, you'd go right back to what you were doing. You try to apply the new skills using your old behavioral pattern. Letting your clients run the show. Guys, here's the thing. You're, you're on a bus right now. We want to put you in a driver's seat and make sure in the passenger seats you have the right clients in the right seats. Does that make sense? 
you're not going to ever no more of this they call you up and say i want to go look at a property now who's had that happen five o'clock i want to go look at a property now we don't you know what we do we send an email to our clients every wednesday saying here's my schedule for the following week i'm available monday afternoon tuesday morning wednesday night thursday afternoon that's how we behave with our clients and so we condition them to work under those guidelines okay now i will tell you if you're working with investors now who are doing the old school old stuff i uh, just go find a bunch of properties make a bunch of offers you're probably going to fire some of them i i did i tried to work with them and you know what i did i i'll give you a hint i would say i will work i will do things your way this time as long as you guarantee we'll do things my way the next time and then you the consumer can decide which way you like best just so you know mr mrs client this is how i work if you do choose this, we work together. If not, that's okay. I wish you wish you well. Actually, uh, he was he's yeah. really more polite. He's very polite. He is because I don't do that. Yeah. <laughs> if, it's either you're gonna do it this way here, then I'm going to teach you, or I don't work with you because I, I, I'm not running around looking for houses for you. I don't have the time, so I'm going to teach you exactly how to do this, and we're gonna work together. But I'm sorry, but. I'm not doing that. And the marketing, by the way, we give you um, is going to attract more of these guys. Exactly. Not so much these guys on here. So it's not like you got to filter through a lot of wheat and chaff. You actually start off with the right kind of people. So I never work sharing with more than four to six investors at a time. That's this is the money circle. This is where money is changing hands, so which means I'm making money. I juggled about thirty and on average. This is a phone call, email once a week. That's all this is, right? But we're not doing. You know how. On, traditional real estate we're all tall you got to have two to three hundred people that's true with other occupants but that's because we're doing a lot of broadcast marketing really like a lot of you know postcards and all that kind of stuff we cut all that stuff out and we go right for the heart of the relationship by using techniques that allow us to give them what they what we've already they told us they need they want based on statistics and we give it to them in formats it's easier to consume including inventory and tools and everything else that's why that's why we get the, the money we get I'm not, I mean, this is about five hours per week per, per client, okay, when you're in production. So that's like 20 to 30 hours a week. That's it. Now, I will tell you, you can scale this up or down as much as you want. I ended up building 11 teams out of this, turning into a big referral business, okay? And um, got a lot more gray here, by the way. <laughs> and I will tell you now, I do more teaching because teaching is more um, fulfilling for me. So uh, if you think about it, when you work on a transaction, you get, it's like an exchange of energy. You get some feedback. It feels good. Just imagine that times 20 people, what that feels like. That's why I tell you, for those of you who are interested in teaching, it is very fulfilling. It is rewarding until you can make money doing this. Um, but we need you to get, we need you to be in production first and master at least three different skills. Uh, we don't, we don't impose, uh, to, be a, to be a MAPS coach, you gotta have 75 transactions a year. We don't impose that here. What we ask is develop competency in three different areas. That's what we ask, okay? And it will take some time Okay, but boy, is it worth it. My gosh, guys, if you guys are really serious about this, um, I promise you, you're not just gonna have more cash flow. Uh, it'll, if it's in alignment with your, how you want your business to grow, um, it'll be a lot more fulfilling. Yeah, so in any case, uh, real quick, you can, you can get this on your own. You don't have to go through the class in KW, but they, are, they do actually charge 3,000 bucks. If you go online and look, that's their actual price. They only give you the price break here uh, because of the relationship between Keller Williams and the, and the, the vendor. Um, so the benefit is if you do it, you do get the credit cost in half. If you don't, you can do it later and uh, either go to another region or they're going to just hit you with their free grant. Um, guys, would you mind terribly if I like grab a chair and sit down? I, no, you're yeah. not allowed. You <laughs> the thing is my, um, my, uh, my voice has gotten used to being booming it out like this all day long, but my, my, my dogs just start barking, you know? You know what's funny? My wife's Canadian, and uh, when I first went up there to teach, we met at a conference, and uh, I said, man, my dogs are barking. You know, and, yeah, like, what's, it, what's this, what's this guy talking about? Yeah. yeah. Okay, um, hey guys, I'm gonna take off my teacher hat, and you can ask me anything you want. That's what you see is what you get, okay? And you can ask and help. I can solve problems. We can talk about transactions. We can talk about the program. Um, I'll stay as long as you guys want, as long as I'm out of here 
in a half hour. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Are there other parts of your license that you need to have or like get certifications in other words? In other words, or like have they all got commercial? No, not necessary. Uh, later on, uh, what, what's your first name? Patricia. Patricia, I would recommend start, uh, save yourself some money. Just start with the program because it's pretty, it's pretty cheap. I mean, the way they price it. And get in the game, get some commissions coming in. Uh, like the commercial designation called CCIM, when I did it years ago, it was expensive back then. It was $1,500 a class times six classes. Sorry, six classes. But right now, we just want you to start right here, right now where you are. Start with the duplexes and triplexes and fourplexes, right? Start with the flips. Start small, get some traction coming in. Not every client's gonna do this, but about 10% of them will. And let me tell you, you get a handful of these guys, you're, you know, you will want to get that designation then, but the point is, you'll have a lot more uh, commissions coming in. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. uh, we just want to start you off in the residential world where there's little risk. There's almost, you got almost no risk here doing this. I mean, literally, you could, I mean, one of your transactions, my gosh, 350 A referral fee on one of your transactions would pay for two programs. <laughs> oh, I forgot to mention this. Um, are any of you on a team right now? You on a team? The folks that are on a team, they will let two people per team share a program. You can share a program, yeah. You have to share the strategy calls too. You can't like run off and do your own separate things. But you can both be on the strategy calls, both be on the webinars, you can get all the material, you can share that. And uh, we encourage that because we want you all to start working together. And feel, we want you to feel good. Gary, can I add one thing yeah. to her uh, question? Mm -hmm. um, although CCIM, is a major uh, designator. KW, we have our own uh, program under the Academic Associations where you are earning a MICP. So you don't have to have yeah, the, the CCIM. Um, KW has M M um, the MICP program. It's like a certification. And it's free. So the designation is takes three years to get. You got to travel, go away for a week every six months, learn, and then you got to produce so much number. You got to have twenty million in production. What he's what Daryl's talking about, we do inside of KW, and it's a nice little step up. It's low risk, right? And so Daryl, uh, you started the program last fall, is that right? Well, for, well, for him, yeah. And he's just already he's already got his commercial certification. So I will tell you this, guys. Um, I. You used to work with you know, everybody that came on late, quite frankly, owner occupants, anybody to raise your hand. Um, and I learned that you will make more commissions faster with investors Gary. than ever with owner occupants. Yeah. I'm not, oh. Oh, congratulations. Okay. Uh, what will happen is Beverly, you're number one, by the way. <laughs> so Beverly's going to send you an email with the instructions to follow. Good for Share you. Negotiate that. that. Well, we're going to team you up with. Uh, uh, Bayville, Point Pleasant, where else was I? Tom's River. River. Yeah. yeah, and then Princeton was part of that too. And then, um, yeah. So the cool thing is, is because we already talked to us in the region, you've already got track record in the region. You've already got people who have gone through the program. Um, and you got ownership who are heavily into investing. So the thing about New Jersey is you're kind of start off with a bit of an advantage over like somebody in Montana. We got one market center. Wait, well, we got more than one market center, but. Um, in Wyoming, we have no market centers. <laughs> so those people, unfortunately, it's hard for us to find the support network that you guys have already built in. In fact, my regional director, John Clyde, is a former New Jersey State Trooper. And he was a Century 21 out here, and he joined KW several years back and uh, helped launch uh, the Washington Township market center down in the south. There's like two different Washingtons here. I imagine uh, two Washingtons in New Jersey. <laughs> so he's, uh, and he also is part of uh, Vineland, I think. Um, but what I'm getting at is he started off as an investor agent. My three of the record, John Clyde, I didn't know that until I met him, right? Um, in any case, guys. Uh, uh, Just curious, when you going to Tom's River? Because I've been I've, going to investment oh, seminars and there. everything with a friend of mine. We've been heavily into this, like, just yeah. recently. And um, when are you going there, do I you know? was there, yeah. Oh, you were there already. Yeah. So tomorrow's Princeton, Thursday's uh, Metuchen. And then, unfortunately, I'm all the way up in the northern northern part of Jersey after okay, that. Okay, I don't know if she went to your class. That's all my Yeah, and then I'll be in New York uh, for September. Um, so, in any case, um, I can, how many of you, 
what's what are your thoughts? Tell me what like what's going through your mind. Like I can see you looking. I mean, you're here for a reason. Everybody came here to learn. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you what I'm thinking. Yeah. And even though uh, and I don't know what you guys are thinking, but was it a lot of information? Mm -hmm. Right. Yes. So, do you kind of feel like I'm me personally? I'm sorting it. So yeah. to make a decision right now, I don't know. You know how many, I usually am pretty cautious about these kind of things because yeah. how, how many of us have signed up for stuff and paid for stuff and then regret it. Now, I don't think that's going to happen here because KW wouldn't have you here if that were the case. Well, so, time on <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So he's got credibility for that. But I almost am not, is anyone else like confused exactly what you're getting and exactly what you can expect? Or I know you said it a couple of times. Yeah. Um, so is that what you're thinking? What, what are you yeah. thinking? Go to those other centers for these electrolyte stuff. No, no, in the beginning, the study groups are usually at the market centers. We um, would have to do one here, like we just got one. Yeah, I would have you start here, one here. Not no. you, you got a plenty big enough proof. I mean, there's, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. My gosh, I'd be shocked if six of you didn't do this. Right. So if half of us did it, we yeah. would have enough for the study group yeah. here. Otherwise, at the beginning, we'd have to go to those other locations every week, whatever. What depends. Uh, we have um, some areas, they'll do like Skype calls and Google Hangouts. I'm a big fan of being in person. That's just how I learn. I like, I want to, like, Louise will see things a certain way, and then Penny will see things a certain way. They both could be right, but you will better go see, oh, I didn't see it that way, and it increases your learning, increases your retention rate too, by the way. But the other thing too about the study groups, you know why we, we trainers like them? There is an element of implied accountability at the group level, and I don't actually have to physically be there. You guys don't want to let each other down. You want to show up prepared. And it takes like an hour a week, that's it. And if I get something, yeah. and I miss something else, and Penny might have that other, that other piece. Yep. So you always work. I mean, it's when I you like went pain. to when you went <laughs> when you went to real estate school. I mean, Sally and I went to real estate school together. If people don't know that, and we had we had a study group, and that's how we met. Yeah. So we would get together as a group, all of us, and we all passed. By the way, I had a friend that I the first school. time. Yeah. Hey, you know what's interesting, guys? At the, the lady that runs exactly. us, her name her name is Beverly. She used to be one of our KW admins. Seriously, she was one of the top admins, and. She liked this program. Where she went to work for them. She knows our culture, one, hands down. Um, I, I will tell you, if you really have a sincere interest in your own personal investing, it's not a requirement, but there definitely is some alignment if you have a personal interest in investing, right? You'll, in other words, you'll have that stick to it. It's just the interest level side. But also, if you like the idea of working with business-minded people, you're going to love the program. That's really the people that excel the most, start the fastest, are the ones that are really enjoy working with a chiropractor or owns his or her own chiropractic business. Because they're business-minded people. It's not as much psychology and psychiatry. It's just easier. I coach, so for me, my energy is there. Yeah. Um, and I've been looking into investing, and I'm um, willing to share that I just took money out of my 401k and put it in a self-directed IRA. And I've been meeting with investors and meeting with hard money people and he, meeting with contractors and everyone and every single person then when they say what do you need I go a push yeah and I've invested before but I put did the traditional way 20% down I was yeah. married at the time I had to sell it you know what I mean so this is my first yeah. by myself and so I've just made this so the synergy is pretty cool for me because I just yeah. started focusing on this again and Wow, Gary. You know how we, you know how we, you know how we get the stick to this is um, it's not really not the study group that helps with the with the retention and the and this uh, what we call velocity, how fast you get to the program and confidence. Mm -hmm. Confidence the because com confidence is anyone else confident? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That's why I'm scared. Please say yes because I know that. Thank you because it's fear, right? Yes. Always fear. It's usually, like you don't feel like you probably know enough, do you? Yeah, because I'm new. Well, that's why we have the program. I promise you this. I can. I, I used to have my own. I used to own my own brokerage, right? And I did an OP team or whole nine yards. You working on a duplex is actually no more complex than a single family home. It's actually probably easier. You know? And the cool thing is, you have support. Yeah. yeah. You and only that. I need my husband to support this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, you check this out. Um, for those of you who are like, just pay for both, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
For those of you who are really interested, how many of you are actually interested in just right now and you got that hesitation out there? You know what I would tell you to do? Turn in your form and put up at the top, Beverly, please confirm first. Grab yourself a spot. It doesn't cost a dime. And then tomorrow, she'll call you. Or somebody will call you and say, we just want to confirm. If you don't answer, they're going to go either. If they don't answer, you know, they just get your form. What I'm getting at is, um, in order for me to kind of hold a spot for you, I've got to have, they're not going to take you seriously when you don't turn the form. They won't process it as long as you say, I need to check with my spouse first or confirm tomorrow. What I'm getting at is get yourself a, a free pass, right? To, to grab a spot. If you end up not using your spot, it just goes to the market center. That's all that happens. And so like a, uh, like a cheat, you can, you can turn in your form. And that happens every week, by the way. Um, and just put up something up top there. So like Louise could say, Louise, what you want to do is just say, um, uh, do, please do not process, please confirm first. Beverly's not going to process your phone. We have, a, we have a question. Yeah. yeah. The question is that in New Jersey, and we're well, particularly here, we're, Monmouth County. Yeah. Monmouth County. There's not many uh, 4, 8, or 16 we're, you know, yeah, yeah, we don't. We don't. We don't. We don't have. We don't, we don't have, yeah, we have to go to Jersey City. There's no duplexes at all. There's none of that. Yeah. Or New York. Can I? Uh, Asbury. Yeah, you're gonna. You're not even gonna. Go. What's your, the tools? You're, how many of you are just focused on the MLS? By the way, that's your main tool. We're gonna get no, you. No, they don't exist. Like yeah. they don't, they don't exist at all. here. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's, I'll show you. you the do zoning that. laws don't. Yeah. In most areas. The, now the thing is, like, say this right here. This doesn't necessarily have her. to be a 16 plex. Mm -hmm. This could be two rows of eight townhomes. You follow what I'm saying? No. Okay. Yeah. That's a uh, different, but I did, I did look at the city data, and you definitely have, uh, you got a pretty active economy here. Pretty active. Because I have business. investors, they buy at, uh, they buy in the same development, one, two, three, six yeah. units. Yeah. That's how I then work with town yeah. you know, But not so like, uh, you you're know, not doing them all at once. Yeah, Correct. Like, one unit they buy like each unit at a time. Well, some of them will have fully bought of this. Now, at the beginning, they're just buying one down here, mm -hmm. but then next year they might pick up two. Then yes, the next year they might pick up four. Doing. Right, but yeah. it's not one deal. It's four. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, but I, what's interesting, that's I'll show you some really cool data for your area. We're talking four deals. Right. City data. What city are you in? I'm going to do Morganville, which is really small. Okay, yeah, small. yeah. yeah oh, do Marlboro. Spread it out Marlboro. to Marlboro. 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 Yeah. I just just for I just want to give you an example. Um, Marlboro, Morganville, still small. Um, There's any. Uh, okay. I just saw this yesterday. Um, okay. Um, do you have some? You have uh, single family detached, single family detached. Yeah. Yeah. There's single family. It's not it's, two four. But you do have some five five plus structures. In the area, I don't know where they are, but you Structures, do. Structures, but they're probably yeah. like they have um, corporate-owned rental yeah, units. Right. Yeah, they're not. I would. You know what I've seen work really well out here, guys, and this is what we're talking about tomorrow night in the webinar. Airbnb. People are freaking just crushing. It's amazing. Yeah, and it's so easy. You know? Former agent here is doing that. He moved down to yeah. um, Charleston, and he says, "Oh, come stay in my Airbnb for free." Yeah. I'm like, "All right, but what?" <laughs> well, think about it. You're actually getting the rates like a hotel. But no, no. But you have to be here something. Oh, you're everywhere. Are we close enough to anything to be in Airbnb? Yeah, I, I stay in Airbnbs when I travel. Yeah, yeah but no, we're not. Not. no, I no, but here no. we're not. <laughs> we have it. You have the we whole shore though. You people, yeah, yeah, you have the whole shore. Yeah. Oh, oh, but oh, but guys. here also in East Brunswick, I know. East Brunswick, yeah, that, that way or that way. They have it. Um, something else before I forget. Um, this will help a lot of you. You know how in the interactive business we're taught we need we need to build our database a lot of people, but focus on a farm area, a small area. Yeah. With investors, it's the opposite. We actually focus on a smaller number of people, but over a broader area. The reason is is, I mean, let's face it. Would you drive a half hour to help a client buy 16 units in a townhome community? Heck yeah. I drive an hour. I drive two hours for that. How often do you have to do that? <laughs> Once. Okay, so in any case, um, I will tell you this. This is. Uh, I don't want to ask him that. I got this from Dave Ramsey. This this will help you a lot. All right, how many of you sure are seriously considering this? Like, if you're, if all the stars lined up for you, you would probably go ahead and do it. If you had the money, the time, and your spouse would say okay. All right. 
Yeah. How many of you know who Dave Ramsey is? Sure. Okay. Yes. So Dave Ramsey showed me this. I was talking to him about his financial peace program. And I, um, I, I wasn't going to do it because I said, well, Dave, I'm already in training. I've got a coach. And we follow what's called, what's called lead with revenue. And he said, let me guess, you're a Kellen Williams agent. And I said, well, I sure am. Well, they know each other. He spoke at our family reunion back in the, like Dallas or somewhere four or five years ago. He said, think of yourself in, in terms of business as a financial statement, okay? Financial statement. How many of you have seen a financial statement before? Like for yourself personally? You should have a P&L, by the way. <laughs> Just yeah. saying. So what Gary Keller is talking about with lead with revenue is income expense. Marketing campaigns and extension the result of commissions is revenue, right? So up here you've got income and expense. Income is commissions, rents, um, interest, right? Interest, things like that. We don't we don't put employee income because we're not employees. <laughs> right? In expense, you've got what you've got your taxes, insurance, maintenance and repairs, yeah, things like that. Yeah, car payments, things like that. That's income expense. Down here is the asset liability side. Assets and liabilities. An asset is your home, right? Home. And you've got stocks and bonds. Stocks and bonds, okay? Liabilities is the principal portion of your mortgage payment. So you got a mortgage on a house, right? That's a liability, would you agree? House is the asset, mortgage is liability. And you might have a car loan, a car loan, something like that. Now he said, look at this, Gary. He said, when you and go into a building, you put in brand new furniture, a brand new roof, a brand new kitchen. Is the building worth more money? Yes. Is it going to make more money? Because you're going to raise the rent. Yes. He said, think of yourself. Either you're going to be down here, either you're an asset or a liability. If you don't ever invest in yourself, if you don't take training, what do you become? A liability. If you invest in yourself, you become a what? An an income producing asset. So you know how to produce income up here. Does this make sense, guys? And I said, well, where do I sign? <laughs> it worked. The point is, is uh, when we talk about red light, green light, we're talking about income expense. Investing in yourself, training yourself is an actual capital improvement. It's like putting a roof on yourself, and now you're, now you're worth more money. Does that make sense? Um, in any case, uh, uh, anything, any other questions? You guys have got some good questions here. I mean, what's your what's your heart telling you? Just look at your career. Yeah. Okay. I mean, it's not a really good program. I mean, this is brand new, so it's a little For the new folks, uh, what I would recommend is this: is um, Daryl's only been in three years. Um, yeah. You know, grab yourself a spot and go home and pray on it. And when you wake up, just do what your heart tells you. There's no wrong answer. It's just what's right for you. If you are saying, no, I can't do it, we just give your spot to the next market center. It doesn't cost anything to do that. But it's a way for you to buy yourself an a evening to think about it, speak to your spouses, things like that. And I think personally you should pray on it, you know, if you're new. For the veteran agents, your decision should be, quite frankly, pretty quick. You're either going to keep doing what you're doing, if that's what you're, is, is you're, you're content, then keep doing that. But if you do want to add additional streams of income and actually make this like a business or invest yourself, the decision is pretty obvious. I mean, this is the only program. And by the way, it is proprietary. Uh, it's only talked to the Kelly Williams offices. So you've got a distinct advantage over the marketplace. You're not getting that more than one or call or bank or rematch. So, in any case, um, uh, that's my story and I'm sticking to it. <laughs> so, Right, real quick, I want to get an idea. I know Louise has got her phone out and um, shared it. Anybody else want to uh, like, reserve a spot and take it over to the back? Okay, let me grab your. Um,